Hey everybody, it's your girl Pleasure Love 87 and I'm coming to you with a tutorial um, a celebrity inspired look by make by Carrie Hilson in the uh, medicine video. I know Makeup by Leanna did it and some other people did an imitation of it, but I'm gonna do my own version of it. So um yeah, here we go. Let's get started. Um I'm gonna start off by using my flat shaded verse, which is my 228 with the white um eyeshadow called Gesso. And I'm not, I'm just going to pat it on. I really want my white to be intense because I don't have a white base. And, um, yeah, I don't, the white base that I think I found out that is very familiar that a lot of people, a lot of girls use. That's why I said people because guys probably use it too, you know. And um, is probably the NYX Jumbo Milk Pencil. And I haven't got it yet. So. You know, I'm working on it, okay? So you want to make sure this all, not all over your lid, but you really want to make sure that you get a good intensity white, okay? Okay, now, on the other side of that shader brush, I'm going to use my pigment called White, right, Frozen White. Um, because in the video it looks kind of like a little frosty color, so I'm gonna use that. On the other side of the brush, and um, I want to make sure that it's really frosty, a little, little glitter to it, like Gary Hilson. We have different complexions, but hopefully it'll come out good. I think it'll be good. I don't know about anybody else's opinion. There might be a lot of fallout. I know usually I have Matt's music in the background, but not today. I don't feel it in the background. And I could be playing the medicine song, but I don't even have that on my iPod. And if I play it off the YouTube, it's going to cut off anyway. So. so, if you have music and you want to have music playing while I'm doing this, go right along. Go right ahead and do it. Okay? So, like that. That's how I'm going to do that. And so now. I'm going to get my pencil brush, and from the the 88 palette, um, oh shoot, okay. from the 88 palette, oh, it came out, I it. so from the 88 palette, I'm going to use ah, that, this brown, kind of right here, for my socket. Oh, that brown came out. That blue. Like, how did it do that? Lady K. Okay. Sorry. So, I'm going to find my socket and just go ahead and do that. Do that. And with my 224 brush, I'm going to dip it in that brown um, a little bit and blend it in. Because as you see in the video, she has it coming in a little bit. So, yeah. You don't want to be dipping um, too much. You still want your white to have that frost in there. Okay. Now, 
Um, I'm going to take the flat shader brush I had before. And um, I'm going to go back in with the white frost, frozen white, because obviously my white didn't just be. So. You got to make sure that your white doesn't go anywhere because then it's not going to look like the way you want it. And I want mine to look very, very frosty white. Like a white frost. I love it. I, just, I like this look. The video was really different from a lot of videos. Um, yeah, so. Hope it's frosty in there. Phew. So, yeah. I'm trying to do this fast because YouTube doesn't allow over 10 minutes. I don't even know where I'm at right now. So, yeah. So now I'm going to get my 217 brush and I'm going to dip it in um, my eyeshadow, my 15 palette. It's called Sketch. It's kind of like a burgundy color, like that. And I'm going to go on top of that brown and blend it in a little bit. Give it a little more depth. Like, you know, more um, intensity look in the outside corner. Because of the simple fact that I can't see how dark or what color she really has on the end. This is my dark color I have to use. So. Sorry. Okay, and then I'm going to use my matte 217 brush, 227, I'm sorry, 227, and my highlight I'm using is Arena. The reason why I'm using this big fluffy brush is because it's a good fluffy brush and it blends, it blends while I'm putting on my highlight, and it's big enough for me to start blending also, so, just in case. Because I know some of you guys use like a smaller highlight brush for it, but no, not me. I use, I still do, it's just, I feel like. Since I only have 10 minutes and I don't even know where I'm at, I would use a fluffy brush to get this look. Okay. Alright. So, that's what I did. And I'm going to put on my eye eyeliner. And so, um, I'll be right back. This is the finishing look. Um, I know in the video I didn't show you how I do the bottom, but I use a black color <clears throat> from the 88 palette and then the dark brown, which is right beneath, right, no, not beneath, above it. And I blend it in and I put it on the bottom. Then I use another lighter brown that's above that darker brown and uh, put it in the middle of it a little bit. So, um, so this is my celebrity inspired look at the end of it. And um, my block spot is going to be pictures. I'm going to take pictures and put on my block spot. I do have a block spot. I just haven't um, put anything up there lately. And um, the only thing I have there, I think it was like an open open diary thing going on. Yeah, I have a pimple right here. So, yeah. Um, but this is my Carrie Hilson inspired look. I hope you guys like it. Um, so leave your comments below. Description on the sidebar and subscribe up top and yeah once again your girl question love sorry for the hair duo maybe i should put it up so you guys like so you guys won't see